negative 6 times the quantity x minus 7. The first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to multiply negative 6 times x. Negative 6 times x is negative 6x. So I just kind of went vertically down uh, on that first part of the problem. The next part of the problem, uh, and you can do this a couple different ways. You can change this to plus a negative. Okay, so what I would do next is I would bring my plus sign down and I would say, what is a negative 6 times a negative 7? Well, negative 6 times negative 7 is a positive 42. So uh, then I look here and I say, can I add a negative 6x plus a 42? Do they have like terms? Well, no, because this first one has an x and the second one doesn't. So my final answer is negative 6x plus 42. If you don't like changing the signs, uh, you can do it this other way. Negative 6 times x is negative 6x. And I'm just going to do this in one step this time. Then what I do is I look at the next part as a negative 6 times a negative 7. Well, what is a negative times a negative? It is a positive. What is 6 times 7? It is 42. Again, can I combine a negative 6x and a 42? No, so my final answer is negative 6x plus 42. Either way you do it is fine. You do what, what you're comfortable with.